The ERC grant um, allowed me to achieve in five years what I would have done in 20 years. Professor Olivier Patron does not disguise the immense importance of the ERC grant he received in 2007. The grant enabled the French professor of linguistics to build a world-class interdisciplinary team. We have uh, philosophers, historians, linguists, paleographers, and we all work together in order to better understand uh, the political science vocabulary. Based at the laboratory at Tilf Inanxi, Professor Bertrand and his team are uncovering the history, meaning and evolution of the political science vocabulary and how it has evolved throughout the centuries. This work is based upon the first translation of St. Augustine's The City of God, in which political words and concepts emerged in the French language for the very first time. Okay, here is the, the manuscript and here is the, uh, the program uh, on the computer that we use to make the transcription. So either on, with this format or with this format, so we can really uh, make a very good edition of the text. 40% of the uh, political science vocabulary that we use today uh, come from this period of the Middle Ages, of the late Middle Ages. So if we want to understand the meaning of the words today, we have to have this uh, historical uh, explanation. In particular, Professor Batrang works on new words and concepts called neologisms and examines their evolution. For instance, the word democracy. The word democracy in French, démocratie, has been created at the end of the 14th century in France, in Paris, um, by a translator of Aristotle's uh, politics. Today, when you look at people using this word, most of them use it with the meaning of liberty. We are not in democracy, means we don't, we don't have liberty or freedom, see? And democracy has a total different meaning if you look at the history of the, of the word. According to Professor Betrang, excellence in his field of research is essentially all about working together with people from different fields of research. My definition of excellence is uh, working together uh, in order to have a better vision of what the future can be. When asked about his dreams for the future, Professor Batrang also stresses the wish for more scientific collaboration across Europe. Actually, my academic dreams for the next decade would be to work with uh, other specialists of the evolution of languages, but not only in French, but also in English, in German, in Spanish, and other languages. Principal chose, mette l'aigle roi, etc. etc.